Some left their homes, other left their jobs just to help neighbors across Kentucky. And for some, it's the first time they are seeing the damage for themselves that claim the lives of 12 people near Bowling Green. News Channel 5's Levi Ismail has the story of how people are using what they can to make a difference and offer hope. You hardly have to know the person next to you to know you're all here for probably the same reasons. It's just amazing to me. These people are incredible. They traveled by the dozens to Bowling Green, Kentucky. Church groups and volunteers all with one mission, to make life easier for those who lost some and others who lost everything. I'm still kind of in awe of the amount, the, just the raw number of people that are here. Zach Jones is a pastor at New Life Church here in the city and says he expected one team after he put out the call for help at his mother-in-law's home. Suddenly, he had three different congregations at the door. In the midst of devastation, people are coming together yeah, I'm in unity, and I, I think that gives a lot of hope. Mary Cook stopped by with her church out of Louisville. She says she just put in her two weeks notice at her job, and on her way here, she was told there would be no job to come back to. When God tells you to come together, we've come together, no questions asked. I'm not, I, I haven't once until you and I've talked, not once thought about my job. Because when people come first, Cook says the rest will handle itself. At least that's how she and others like Michelle Davis find purpose in this chaos. When things were at the worst that morning, I thought, you know what? This is what we're going to do. Davis runs the consignment shop Elite Repeats, where it's still relatively intact. She can't say the same about her neighbors. So now she, too, is doing what she can with what she has. Davis is salvaging clothes, not to sell, but to donate. We're just going to start donating and putting them in sizes and tubs and taking them to the facilities that need them because these families have lost everything. Davis says insurance will take care of getting her back and running. So this is the least they can do for the people who've kept them in business this long. Not that it matters who you are. She says if you need help, it's never too far away. Reporting, Levi Ismail, News Channel 5. It's great to see all the support, Levi. Thank you. And if you would like to offer physical donations, New Life Church in Bowling Green is collecting materials for care packages, and they can also deliver these packages to your home.